So I'm over here cutting grass in the dark. I'm wearing a clear safety goggles so I can see clear. I, I wear like dark shades in, in the daytime. That way the sun doesn't reflect. And you know how I used to use the magnifying glasses and all that. Then I use the mask to stop like rust. Connected. See that train, those trains over there? That's where the movie, I think what, 1877 or Yellowstone or 1923, one of them movies was filmed here in Galveston over there. But uh, this, this actually, this strip is like three blocks long. And uh, as you can see, it's pitch black. Normally I'll be trying to Uber and make some money. I think I could have been further along, but I went and made y'all guys a video with Simone the Goat earlier. Uh, Y'all seen the, the big yard I did this morning, the tall grass. I excluded the office. You know, I didn't want to be repetitive. But the whole, and the mosquitoes come out at night. These are the ones that have the poison. But I might not finish. I edged all the way over there. But if you want to see a video of me weed eating, just type in my name and put weed eating behind it. I got a video that got over 15,000 views or something like that. I got a couple of them. And you can see how good I was weed eating years ago. Uh, I did a demonstration and I had one of my uh, helpers, a guy that was working with me, co-worker, assistant, whatever you want to call him, he was uh, filming me. See, in the future, I will have people filming me and I'll have my GoPro on. Uh, but yo, it's your guy, Mr. Y2K, man. And your boy Boosie went to jail today. Boosie went to jail, or he got the warrant uh, set out for him. I'm gonna tell you why all these rappers and everybody go to jail. Cause I'm from the old school. Back in the day, if you went to jail, even to this day, then it kind of gave your street credibility that you was really who you say you was or claim to be and it, it made you uh it made people feel uh close to you like they could relate to you because most of the fans some of the fans the culture of the fans basically was in trouble all the time it showed that because you had money you wasn't way out of touch with us uh but the thing is instead of y'all growing out of going to jail to prove who y'all are and evolving showing people that you don't have to go to jail going to jail is dumb like y'all could be cops you could you could promote being a cop why why don't y'all promote being cops if y'all hate cops because cops are crooked why don't y'all promote being cops why don't y'all promote the younger generation to be cops if y'all bragging on guns or the military, y'all can have all the guns you want legally. Big guns. Then you could uh, patrol your neighborhood and ensure and clean up your streets and get all the people that's doing dumb shit. Because it is people that do dumb shit. They not even getting paid for the dumb shit they do. They just doing dumb shit just because they, they lost. It's up to us to help y'all be found bro see it used to be people telling me what i should do and all this and look where i'm at today i'm an example bro i'm an example to the people now i've been an example for a while but just me showing and telling people that the streets ain't do you think they want me telling y'all that the streets not good bro do you honestly think that look boosie went to jail for death of a service, $8,000 for not paying the limo. Even if you decide to pay it now, the charge has already been picked up. Yeah, you can pay it, but the charges are still, the state can pick it up. Why would you cause yourself another felony? You already out on bond. They could drop your bond for $8,000, bro. And you got money. And even if you did got money, that's worth pawning something. If I got to go pawn something to stay straight, 
I'ma do that. Why would you? This Texas. They don't need evidence in Texas. They just need word of mouth. This is the Lone Star State, bro. Bro, I don't I know wherever you been at, they they give y'all mass of time, but they let y'all run wild over there. Ain't none of that. This like the old Cape Corral around here, man. Listen, bro. Hey. Somebody told me this when I first got sober. They said, bro, if you just spend half the energy that you spent when you was on them streets doing the right thing, <laughs> you're going to be good. Guess what? I don't even think I'm using half the energy, bro. I don't, I, I probably use a little more than half. I ain't going to count. That's count. That's count. Because I give it 110%, bro. Now, I can't say that because I'm making these videos. But these videos, I'm putting in work too, bro. Look. So, my thing is, this is the thing. I'm mentally ill too, bro. If you see my truck, it's like hoarders on wheels, bro. Everything I got is, 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 is like, I'm got a mental disorder, bro. Why you think everything junky, disorganized? That's schizophrenia, bro. The shopping sprees I used to go on, all of the, 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 what, the, I'm a real schizophrenic. That's a fact. I, hey, I've been getting crazy chicks. Yeah, I've been to psych wards. All of them. State hospitals. Incompetent to stand trials. Homeless. On drugs. Violence. Bro, if I could do it, bro, look at me. Begging y'all, bro. Just do a little bit at a time. Look, look at that weed eater, bro. I can crank this bitch up with one hand, bro. I do this with one hand, bro. Look, I'm working in polos. <laughs> Polo. Yeah. This ain't the hoodie. This ain't the uh sweater hoodie. I got an orange sweater hoodie. That got a pocket. This don't got no pocket. But yeah, man. Look, man. Why would Boosie look look at the, the insanity in that? Bro, if you got that kind of money, man, I don't want nobody around me that's fucking up. Yo, we could chop it up. But no, that's it. Because guess what? You guilty. He was with him. Shout out to the game spittle. He was with him. Guilty by association, bro. I'm not giving you no shot at false, give it, put no false allegations on me. I screenshot where I'm at and video where I'm at at all times. How you gonna say I was over there? I am filing charges. And suing. And, uh, huh, checking your release date. I'm not, and putting a, 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 a bond, uh, 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 yeah, safety bond on you. Yeah. And putting a statement. Yeah. Shit. Now where I'm at today, I might even file charges. No, I'm most definitely filing charges. Yeah, I'm most definitely filing charges. Yeah, so you might retaliate on that. I don't know what you're gonna do, and don't really care, cause at this point, guess what? Now, as far as us doing something together, I get caught and telling on you. Nah, I ain't gonna do that. Has it been done to me several times? Several times. Several. Am I mad at the people that did it? No, man. I I knew that's what I signed up for. I'm in the game of Tattletales. Yeah, man, I used to watch the game some movies, how everybody was a snitch. That's part of the game, bro. Backstabbing, all that part of the game, bro. Yeah, but anyway, I'm going to get back to y'all, man. Hey, man, I appreciate y'all giving me feedback and views on this real talk on, on me giving y'all life lessons from a dude that really been there done that because hey 
no, normally I don't get too many views on this and I can't share it. I'm trying to get it to the point where I can get 20, 30 so I can be like Eric Thomas in this thing. You hear me? The art of war, baby. No, I'm out, man. I love y'all, man.